Now there is the other possibility, which is that when you were recording, there was something that just didn't come out right, or the intonation is not right, and you want to redo it. But you don't want to redo the entire recording. Logic has a really easy feature to use called quick swipe comping. And what it allows you to do is just re-record that section that you want and easily edit that new fragment in without having to do a whole lot of work. I'm going to zoom back out just a little bit. And I'm going to go into this area and re-record a little bit of this. So we have the playhead set up. The R should still be flashing on your track. And I'm going to go up to the record button, click record, and now I'm going to begin talking over that section that I wasn't satisfied with. And when I'm done, I am going to press the stop button. And what happens right away is we see that logic expands and we have the new section that's above the old one. What we can do now is we just drag the area that we want to use and Logic will automatically fade between those two recordings. So what this allows you to do is do your original voiceover, do any of the spots again that you're not quite satisfied with, and maybe it's even just half of that phrase that you re-recorded which you really want to use. You can do your quick swipe comping and then it allows you to just keep that section that you want. And when you're done with all of this, you can click the little disclosure triangle up over here. It closes everything together, so you can't even really tell that you've done these adjustments other than these faint vertical lines. You can zoom out, and what you should be looking at is the final waveform of the voiceover that you are proud of and that you want to export.